This video is sponsored by Eastar. Ever wonder what a $400 drum set from Amazon sounds like? Well, you're about to find out. And you might be kind of surprised. So it's been a while since I even looked at a cheaper beginner drum set. So when Eastar reached out to me, I figured, hey, this kit looks decent. Let me check it out. And compared to my first drum set, this thing is a huge upgrade. Believe it or not, this is made out of birch. My first drum set was made out of basswood, which is super soft and sounds horrible. So already this is a huge upgrade. It has a 10 by 7 and 12 by 8 rack tom, a 16 by 16 floor tom, a 20 by 18 inch bass drum, and a 14 by 5 and a half snare. These are pretty standard sizes. My first drum set had massive toms that were impossible to tune and really annoying to mount. I guess my only small complaint with this drum set is the bass drum. It'll be cool to see a 20 by 14 or even a 20 by 16 instead of a 20 by 18. This kit also comes with a bass drum pedal, a hi-hat stand, a snare stand, one cymbal stand with a boom arm and a throne. But not gonna lie, the first thing I'll switch out would be the throne. And of course, this isn't like the top of the line hardware, but compared to the hardware that came on my first kit, again, this is a massive improvement, especially the tom arm. L arm systems are by far the most superior way to mount a tom. Plus with this one, you have an extra clamp if you wanna expand down the road. And my only small complaint with the hardware is with the floor tom legs, they are kind of short for me. It also comes with a set of 14 inch hi-hats and a 16 inch crash. Again, not gonna lie, I didn't use these. The symbols would be the second thing I would upgrade after the throne. But if you are just starting out, then these will do just fine. So now, more importantly, how does this drum set sound? I have all the stock heads on it. There's only muffling on the inside of the bass drum, but all the other heads are wide open. I am using my own cymbals because, well, we all know how the stock ones sound. And also, I am using my own hardware, but I do have the one cymbal stand set up.
So this is actually a pretty killer drum set. I honestly did not plan on keeping this kit after this video, but after playing on it and recording with it, I just might have to. I know I talked about my first drum set a bunch, but that's because I wish I had this one instead. This thing is a huge improvement, and honestly, this is like an intermediate drum set at the price point of a beginner kit because of a lot of the little things that you don't really think about when purchasing your first drum set or things that you don't really know about. For example, the number of lugs, this bass drum is a 10 lug bass drum. Typically beginner kits are eight, maybe even six. The snare drum has 10 lugs. The one on my first kit only had six. Both of the rack toms are six lug drums, which is pretty standard, but I've seen smaller drums like the 10 inch with only five and sometimes even just four. And the floor tom is also a six lug, but it would be cool if it was an eight lug instead. So all of that combined with the fact that this is a Birch drum set makes this a very sound investment if you're looking for your first kit. So if you are interested in this kit, there is a link down below. Be sure to like and subscribe and also let me know in the comments what you thought about this drum set. Would you play it or would you not play it? Was it better than your first drum set? Do you have a drum set? Let me know. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you in the next one.